how long can you actually leave your Dyson air purifier on? And that is a great question. Well, actually, for example, if you're using this one right here, where it's like the auto mode, as you can see, and you have it not on the absolute like biggest uh, like level, basically. So if you're not like turning, turning it on like way, way up, then basically you can leave it the entire night. That at least what I've done now for the past week and it has worked pretty fine for me. What I'm going to do basically, I'm going to of course turn this one on and then I'm going to click where it says auto right here and then I'm just going to leave it for the night. And for me, I have, as I said before, I have done it for about one week and it's been working fine for me. But make sure that you try it out. Maybe try it out for one to two hours, for example, when you're not sleeping, maybe when you're working or doing something, just try it out for one to two hours, see if it actually is able to do so. And if it's able to do one to two hours, most likely it's going to be able to do a lot more than that. And approximately, I think I read somewhere that it has more than 2000 hours or maybe even up to 4000 hours before you can actually change the filter on it. So I think that you have a lot of hours on it for sure, depending on how much you have used it before, of course. But basically, yeah, that is the answer to the question.